We have our own neuro ICU, uh, which houses the critically ill neurosurgical and neurology patients. So for instance, a patient with a ruptured aneurysm, a subarachnoid hemorrhage, would go to that unit. A patient in status epilepticus, a neurology patient, would go to that unit. And I think the reason why our, our, our care is better is because they're all housed in the same unit, so the nurses are all familiar with that uh, uh, point of care and, and, and strategy of care for those type of diagnoses. People trained in neurocritical care typically understand not just the critical care aspect of medicine, but also have special expertise in the brain itself. So they're able to, the, you know, the physiological aspect of being in a critical care unit of, you know, how critical care illness, how it affects the brain in particular. Uh, I think you have an edge when you're being treated by a neurointensivist in that situation versus in an, any other center that just has critical care but not dedicated neurointensivists. We have dedicated nurses who are ICU trained especially in with respect, regards to the brain. So the care that you get is Q1 neurochecks, which means every one hour, every aspect of the brain and the brain stem is checked for more closely. Uh, for any change in exam, uh, it triggers a set of studies that we, we would find necessary. We're very proud of the neuro IC. It is not something that's commonly seen throughout hospitals. We have highly specialized, highly trained, very dedicated nurses. We have a critical care specialist who has neuro background and neurointensive care fellowship training. We have the capability to handle any nervous system problem. And that's uh, really important to support the mission of treating anything that comes through the door, no matter how complex. Often the surgery itself may not be the biggest part of the problem, often the patient's health is the biggest part of the problem. So having the ability to provide extremely high level critical care with very dedicated professionals supporting the patients and taking care of the patients is a huge asset.